All right, hello. Welcome back to another episode of Mario and Luigi Brothership. Still feels pretty surreal to me that I'm playing this game, honestly. And honestly, I feel like this game does kind of have a slow start. Like, I've played about four hours of this game, and I feel like it is taking a little while to get going, you know? Like, we haven't had a boss yet, we recently got our hammers, no bros attacks, surprisingly. I think this might be the longest you ever go without bros attacks in a Mario and Luigi game. Which, um... I don't know, it's kind of similar to how you get the Morph Balls so late in Metroid Dread. It's kind of giving me those kinds of vibes, but maybe that means the game will be good, I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, uh, instead of actually going to where we need to go, we're gonna go back to the Twisty Island. So we can get some secrets that we missed. See, this is an example of, well, I'd say quote-unquote mandatory backtracking that I don't mind, because, you know, new shit opens up, so you might as well go there anyway. I came from Rumbla Island to visit this place. Cool island, huh? But hey, did you hear about this? Rumors are flying about transparent blocks. Can't see them, but they're there. I doubt they show up in funny little places like this, though. Yeah, so I I did I did notice these. No. This is Twisty Island. Thanks to you two, my spiel's not a lie anymore. I really owe you. I really like this song. This song I was listening to this song for like a while. I climbed the leaves to the very top of my boyfriend recently. I nearly cried when I saw the lighthouse connected with Ship Shape Island. <laughs> oh. I came here forever ago on a date so I could climb the twist and surround my girlfriend. Now he finally can. The lighthouse was higher than I thought. It was a tiring climb. But the view is beautiful, so I know I'll remember this date forever. So we can go over here. Look at all these funny flowers. Hey, heard about Grampy Turnips? They say those guys have been going in Concordia soil for a long time. Don't know if that's helpful or not. I know it's kind of strange to think about. I did find one, and I don't know what the point of it was. Besides the witty dialogue, I guess. Oh, well, there's probably one right here. <laughs> hey! I'm the Twisty Island, Grampy Turnip. I could really feel the rhythm in that plucking. I heard a sweet, sweet melody drifting over from east yonder, didn't I? I know I did. You fine gentlemen pluckers were singing and cutting a rug over there, weren't you, eh? Ah, the sound of it made me want to unfurl my old roots and stretch out a bit more. Yes, music's the most wonderful thing. It's a cell for every ailment, don't you think? Music's just the thing if you want to wind yourself down or get yourself going. Sure, it's not exactly medicine, but it can heal your hurts and give you a pick-me-up. So, when I think to myself, oh my, I'm so very, very tired. I listen with both ears. If you try to do lots of things at the same time, your brain gets surprisingly worn out. At times like that, you gotta let yourself do nothing and zone out to just the music. You ought to make a mental note of any advice from Twisty Island's Grampy Turnip. Now, I've got one more thing to say. What does music have in common with a door? The answer is... If you want in, you gotta have the right key. Heard that already? Sorry. <laughs> oh yeah. So anyways, I finally finished watching the frickin' Odyssey Mario 2D level ranking video. <laughs> I finally got around to watching it. I, well, by watching it, I mean I finally finished binging it because it was frickin' seven hours. So it took me a while to finish. And I'm glad to say that I finally finished all of it. And uh, I won't spoil what the final level was, but I recommend watching it. It is, it is very entertaining. <laughs> and uh, now that's one less thing I, I have to watch on YouTube. <laughs> the only other, other thing I've been binging, as you know, is... um. Joel's uh, Doom Mapping Contest 2 from, like, 2019. 
or I guess 2018, I think it was. That I've been watching for the past like half a year. It's taken me forever to get through it just because I've been so lazy about watching YouTube and shit. But yeah, I did finally finish. I'm about to finish watching that soon too. And um, I'm on the final part, and I have I have like three hours left to watch as well. So yeah. <laughs> That's something that I will eventually get around to finishing, though. Hey, glad you found this spot. I love it. Nice and quiet. I come here to get away from all the hullaboo around the stage. Nerf! And Moonie. Mario! 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 Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> still never gets old. Oh yeah, the guy the guy with his ass crack. Here, let's go let's go around the island and see if we can do anything new. Well, we probably can. Hey no no no, maybe we'll get level up. <laughs> yeah, a good way to start off the battle with a burp. Excellent! Oh, yeah. oh, we are not getting to level 8 for a while. Oh, shit. So, there's a lot of- there's a lot of YouTube videos I want to finish watching. It's a really stupid thing that I just binge YouTube videos for like the- like over the course of like six months. I don't know. On some hands, it feels like a waste of time, and other hands, it feels like... It feels rewarding. Oh, we got another Lucky. I don't know. Yay! But, I mean... Let me look at my, uh... Let me look at my watch later, because that's mostly what I pull from. I just pull from the stuff that I have in my watch later. So, let's see what I have in there. Um, I have, uh, the Doom Mapping Contest 2, I have Nico B's Persona 3 Reload Let's Play, which I still never finished, <laughs> because, you know, I already played through Persona 3 Reload myself, so reliving all of that is gonna take a while. Um, I'm recently watching Vinny play the Silent Hill 2 Remake, in addition to him playing Mario Party Jamboree, and, uh, a new video that came out um, 13 hours ago is Good Vibes Gaming's, uh, Sonic, 3D Sonic games ranking. I don't know, I, I, maybe, maybe, call it, call it Brain Rot, call it whatever. I don't know, I just love ranking videos for some fucking reason. I mean, to be fair, I've always loved them, though, ever since I was a kid. So, I just think, I don't think that's changed, it's just that ranking videos have changed over the course of the years. Because, um, the thing is, we- ranking videos used to be, like, you know, top tens, right? But now ranking videos have become long form, and now it's like, let's rank literally everything from worst to best. And that's how- that's how ranking videos have, like, come along over the course of the, you know, what, 15 years I've been watching- Well, I don't know if I've been watching them for 15, let's say 10 years. I've been watching ranking videos for 10 years, and they've, uh, definitely evolved. I'd argue for the better. I, I like how they- I like how they are. The first person I can really think of that did the whole, like, ranking worst the best thing really well is, uh, ironically, Nathaniel Bandy. I know I like the shit on Nathaniel Bandy a lot. But, uh, I do genuinely think that his, um, uh, what you call it, his, uh, like, ranking videos are pretty good. <laughs> it's one of the few videos from him that I do watch nowadays, still. Christy Leaf. I'm assuming we want to keep those materials for later. Even though we haven't been able to use any- we haven't been able to do anything with them yet, and I don't think we will. Until, like, probably after the boss or something. 
Okay. I already see something we can do here. We got a mushroom. I don't want them. Also, interestingly enough, um, Luigi doesn't always count as a, like, solid character anymore. Which I also find kind of weird. Yeah, let's get rid of the frickin' boars. The boars are annoying, because they call for backup. These guys are more deal- deal- dealable? That's a- that's a weird word I just invented. Dealable. One thing I do love from Paper Jam onwards is that you can actually see the levels of the enemies you're fighting. I don't remember if Dream Team did that first. I know Paper Jam did it for sure, though. And that's always been a feature that I really liked. A pretty underrated feature, I might add. You know, just being able to see the, en the levels of the enemies you're fighting. Probably the reason they added that feature was because of the card system, though. <laughs> Since, you know, you can lower the levels of certain enemies. And it's nice to be able to see what levels they actually are. Maybe we will get to level 8 after all. Look at that, we're already halfway there, and I barely started the episode. Also, you wanna know something crazy? Zack still hasn't gone back to me. He's just been dead all day. So, no down bad addition today. <laughs> so, which means I got to record three episodes of Brothership today. So, I mean, hey, that's not something I get to do very often. Man, I'm getting all the luckies today. We're gonna get that lucky achievement sooner or later, then. Oh, yeah, here comes the backup. Could you, in theory, grind this way by killing infinite big boars? Uh, maybe not. I think they only call for one big boar at a time. Punch that sucker. <laughs> There's a lot of personality in the dialogue, though, as usual. Which is something that Mario and Luigi get, or just Mario RPGs have been killing at recently. They've just been killing at it with the dialogue. Um... You're able to see where their flowers are on the map, right? Yeah. So we're done. We're done in this place. To my knowledge, there isn't anything else in this place. <laughs> I know that's gonna annoy some people, but I just find it funny. Your mustache is a work of art. Yeah. Alright, we're leaving. Now we're going back to Rumbla Island. Which I'm assuming is, you know, a pun on Rumble. I don't know if that's what the actual pun is. <laughs> Luigi can just look like constantly confused, which is hilarious. You know, it is kind of it also it is also a really cool reference that um freaking blue pipes from Paper Mario are in this game because in in Dream Team they're golden pipes. And in Paper Jam, they're paper craft pipes. But in this game, nah, we're going back to the old classic. We're doing blue pipes. What the fuck happened here? The freaking the freaking island got ruined, dude. Oh, look who showed up! Those punks I mentioned went running for their boss. 
I got all the islanders to scram, but their statues, all their art. Rep the art. Break it, breaking is good. Oh, this guy. This guy is from the, uh, the trailers. So get started. Well, we're actually gonna get our first boss after four and like five hours of gameplay. Their bosses hold up to the east. You two better do something. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Time to square up again. We haven't fought these guys in a sec. Are they still weak? No, they're these guys are stronger. They're level six now. Oh, now they have new tactics. Boom. See, they have, uh, they have new tactics now. And I'm still a dumbass and jumped on the wrong part. That's a go. This is a good, uh, this is a good way of showing you, like, hey, enemy, some enemies to be hammered, you know? Oh, yeah. I would like to level up before I fight the boss. That would be sad. I mean, is either I get it before or after the boss? I don't really care too much. <laughs> oh! <laughs> the freaking Luigi voice clip is amazing. You guys are strong. Just fight like that and take down the big boss. The boss. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it can't be, but is Grumbla behind all this? That Grumbla, what a naughty kid. Rip, rip all the art, though. The connector flowers just bloomed. I won't let any monsters destroy them now. Yeah. I mean, we, we've basically explored here already, in, like, an episode or two ago. The main monster isn't holding back anymore. Look what it did to our art. Can't anyone stop this? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, time to break this rock. Is that rock is gone for good now? So, these, do these enemies actually level up? No, there's still level one. <laughs> Makes me wish I had um a better way of dealing with them. Maybe an all-out attack would be nice. Got him. Yeah, you only, you only get four XP for those guys, anyway. Hawking turnips. Are they just used for, like, info, or what? Hey, I mean, you never know, I can kill a few of them with a first strike, so... That's always good. Yeah, with a lucky. Flying start. Ooh! Yo, I got be- Wait, the beans are colored! It was col- it was colored right there. So I'm confused, are the beans Bowser's in a story or not? Oh, yeah. Okay, not worth fighting those guys, though, besides that. Especially when the load times between uh, zones are, are so, um... You know... Also, we need, to, we need to go up so we can get, um... Also, we can't... What the hell is that marker? That's the lighthouse, right? We need to get the other nectar, but we couldn't go up there because it was being blocked off. Nice, uh, nice, nice coins I have too, by the way. Yeah, I should probably, I should probably look at these. Let's see. Um, where did we leave off? Ark reveals that someone seized the Great Lighthouse Island. For now, Mario and Luigi head to Twisty. Sail the currents to reach Twisty, and then meet with Make It on the island. 
Mario and Luigi visit Twisty, a wildly lush island with a stage, as they go in search of Wilma's daughter, Make It. Meet with Make It, who's somewhere on Twisty, explore the island. Wilma's daughter, Make It's up at the Twisty's lighthouse. She's got stuck when the Twisty, Twist and Sprout shrunk. Find a way to, upper air, to the upper area where the lighthouse is. Help Stranded Make It get down from up there. Groove Master off his groove. Groove Master Dio has lost his groove on the stage in the center of town. He needs hair wax. The Groove Master feels off his game when his hairstyle isn't in top shape. Help him with his hair crisis. <laughs> Met wax Maker in the woods. Max Glam Wax is out of stock. Mario and Luigi must go to Squash Moshy Forest to find Spiralia, who makes it. Spiralia seems to be famous for her top quality hair wax. Find her somewhere in the woods. Spiralia's bug disgust. Spiralia can't get past the bugs in the forest. Help her return to her workshop so she can make more wax. Spiralia decides bugs. Carry her to her shop, but avoid touching any creepy crawlies along the way. Groove Master Grooves. Mario and Luigi carried Spiralia throughout the forest, avoiding bugs, and got her safely to our shop. Deliver the wax to Diode. He'll get his hairstyle in top shape with it. And then he'll have his groove back. A revived Twist and Sprout. After Diode got his groove back with Max Glam Wax, Mario and Luigi did a dance, reviving the Twist and Sprout. Climb the Twist and Sprout, and then meet Make It at the lighthouse. Then we have, uh, Build It and Make It Reunite. At the lighthouse, Make It says she worries about her family. She'll sing on stage and then go to Ship Shape. Visit with Build It and Make It. Speak with friends on Ship Shape. Then we have Save Rumbla Island. Siblings Build It and Make It are alarmed to hear that their home Rumbla is under attack. Head to Rumbla Island. Prepare for battle. And then, oh no, we have oh no, oh no, Grumbla. Rumbla is in, is in trouble as enemies are running amok on the island, destroying its work of art. Find out where the big monster's located and defeat it. And what about our challenges? We still can't unlock these. Oh, I'm getting close for the I'm getting close to the counterattack one. And this one. Still haven't done item buffet. <laughs> I mean I could get that pretty easily, honestly. Flying starts. Start battles with first strikes 30 times. Still haven't done that yet. <laughs> I don't think I've unlocked any new ones. Deal a thousand damage or more with one attack. Now, apparently we have only done 43 max. That's sad. This one I want to get as soon as possible. And then I won't have to worry about game overs. So yeah, it doesn't seem like I have anything new. I'm assuming the achievements are linked to, um... What do you call it? I get the feeling they're linked to, like, the bros attacks that we haven't unlocked yet. Who knows, though. Okay, so we need to go to the village. I came to see the sights. I didn't think anything bad could happen. With well, the villages aren't destroyed, maybe I'll go back to Rainforest. I've got my hands totally full protecting the village. The monster in charge is up to you. Good luck with that. Uh, some guard you are, huh? Alright, Linguini, it's time to unearth the vegetables. Welcome to Rumbla Island. Please ignore all the chaos around us. The monsters are out of control. It's gonna ruin tourism again. Hello, dear customers. Are you gonna bring down the big guy? Yay! Then you'll need to be prepared with gear. Just like I need to make a living, you understand. Uh, well, we still have the so so boots. I guess, I suppose we could upgrade Mario's defense. There we go. Now we're doing better on on equipment. Oh, I have an extra so-so hammer, I forgot about that. Hmm. Oh. Well, yeah, Luigi needs to get first strikes for that to be useful. 
I still have all this crap. Well, I don't know. Let's try something. What happens if I sell all these twisty leaves? Did, did that do anything? <laughs> did I get new armor? How do you feel? Y'all set? Then teach that big guy a lesson. Honey, have you, have you been to the shop in front yet? They sell items there. You might find something useful in their stock. Oh. It's about like your level. Have you been working towards raising it? Don't take on the boss unless your level is high. Battle weaker foes would do that. I mean, self-explanatory RPG stuff, really. <laughs> Ooh, I think we're about to fight our first boss in this game, guys. That's pretty exciting. Well, it's only been 25 minutes, too. I'm more excited to hear what the boss music sounds like, because that's always, like, a really hype moment in, um, Mario & Luigi games. Thanks for lowering the drawbridge. Oh. That... This is why I'm not talking to too many of the NPCs, unless it's, like, my first visit, you know? Mario! Oh. Oh. So I think this is new. We haven't been up here in a while. Yeah, so we're gonna go around and have a look. Whoa! Ooh. Yeah, this is something I wasn't able to get before. More so-so boots. I already have those, bro. That's so lame. <laughs> well, uh, something to sell later, I guess. I'm just checking to see if there's any hidden blocks around, you know? Thing is, is the games are dropping so many items, and I haven't needed to use any yet, so... That's the thing. I find that the hammer noises aren't as satisfying in this game. They don't make that, like, satisfying, like, swinging noise they do in all of the other Mario Luigi games. Like, it really feels powerful in the other games. But not so much in this one. Huh. Ah, what's this shit right here? Oh, I don't know! Hmm. We need a bit of Luigi oh. logic. Break it all apart. Nobody pays attention to me, I hate this. Okay, fine, more breaking. I'll break all of it. Oh, that guy's like bad news, Mario. Oh, we got these guys. It's good that we get to... Oh, a level 5 Seedle. So, you know, that's more like it. I don't think you can use the D-pad for the menus. Bye. <laughs> Get out of here! Oh yeah, we are gonna get a level up before the boss. That's gonna be hella hype. That's the one place I think this game's gonna truly excel at is the rank up bonuses. And the exciting thing is that I've never played this game, so I don't know what the best rank up route is. So that's gonna be especially exciting. <laughs> Lol. Did I even get the hammer first strike? Yeah, I did. My attacks don't work. Enemies have various characteristics. Some enemies protect their heads to block a jump attacks or take the air to avoid the hammer attacks. <laughs> yeah, like how we finally get that um, tutorial. Yeah, you know, honestly, I could have gone all game without seeing that one. But, whatever. Oh, 
Try to do a ra try to pull the ball and race ready. I'm gonna release it to swing. Oh, we got hammer count. We got hammer counters now. All right. Oh. Wasn't ready for the rock, bro. <laughs> I knew he was throwing at Luigi, but it came out really freaking quick. Yeah. Alright, we're at shell rank. Every time you rank up, you can choose a rank up bonus. That is really cool. So, a oh, quick leveling, that's not a bad one. Well, obviously go for gear slot one <laughs> as soon as possible. Yay! Alright, so next rank is Boomerang rank. That's not what rank it was in originally, was it? Wait, hang on. Let me double check this. <laughs> in, um... What is it in Paper Jam again? Um... Am I stupid? Where is- where's Paper Jam's at? Oh no, it is pa it is Boomerang rank in Paper Jam. Okay. So it goes Boomerang, Flower, Leaf, and then Star, and then Rainbow. So that might actually be the same, then. Where the fuck is, like, the fanfare? It feels so, like, soulless. Also, yeah, it does- it is- it is the same ordering. I think they could add a bit of- I think they, they, there really should be a fanfare when you rank up, bro. It's like, uh, it, now it just feels like, like, oh cool, like you ranked up, I guess. <laughs> Doesn't feel that exciting. Come on, let's kill this seedling. Okay, there is a bit of effort that'll go into getting to the boss, so that's a good thing. So these guys are basically the Goombas of this game. <laughs> Which is good, because, you know, we need unique Goomba-like enemies. Like how we have Beanies. Beanies, Shrewblitz, um, Goombules, Grombas. You know, I like all the I like all the unique first enemy type, you know, types in, uh, the Mario and Luigi games. Those are always fun. And I'm glad this game has that. I mean, even, even Paper Jam kind of had one, too, with the Paper Goombas. Nerd. Yeah, thanks for Luigi- thanks, Luigi, for picking up the slack when I can't. Woohoo! Look at all this. Look at all this stuff. Go time! That is also ripped straight out of Paper Jam. Yeah, surprisingly, for all the pe for all the times that people shit on Paper Jam and me coming to absolutely love Paper Jam, it's great to see just how much of that game is actually referenced. <laughs> and now we're actually in like a more fresh Mario and Luigi game. It is like hella, hella cool. Well, what I'm saying is, it's cool that we have all this Paper Jam stuff in an actually unique Mario and Luigi game. It really makes it, like, the best of both worlds. You got the creativeness of Dream Team, but then you have the awesome mechanics of Paper Jam. Oh, so I want to go over here, because I saw Moony. 
Yeah, there was like there's there's some mini in here that I can get. Yeah. Oh. The guy the guy playing the draw bore organ is having a lot of fun over there. <laughs> At least I think it's a draw bar organ. It might be a different organ for all I know. But yeah, I, I'm loving the music in this game so far. So far, so far, not a lot of it. Like, so far, I'm not, like, it's not that too memorable. But I do love it. Also, I think, if I'm not mistaken, that's all of the. All the things on this island. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. All right, Luigi, put that down. Well, Luigi, just give it to me so I can do it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of interesting how much this place has changed since we are last here. Wahoo! I need to go. I gotta need to go refill my juice after this battle. I think. <laughs> I can't wait till the game actually gets challenging. That'll be when the, the game really starts to shine. I mean, I think, I think, um, you know, what do you call it? I think Paper Jam is like a genuinely challenging game at points. Well, it was when I was a kid until I learned out how to fucking cheese the game with the card system, though. <laughs> And this game doesn't have a card system to rely on, so... Oh, yeah. oh actually, wait, that gives me a thing. I, I just thought of something. Are there gonna be badges in this game? Because if there's gonna be badges in this game, that would actually be pretty dope. Alright, Mario, we gotta grab this thing. Oh, yeah, Luigi! Oh, yeah. This big-ass fucking thing! Plug in. We gotta find another one. We gotta find another one. Another one. Dang, bro, my playtime is already six hours. I mean, I saw again. Some of that is me idling, so I don't know how much of that actually counts. But we'll see. Uh, I didn't go in here yet. This looks like it's got the goods in it. Wahoo! So yeah, honestly, besides, um, playing this game, there's not really a whole lot I actually did today. <laughs> besides watching YouTube and hanging out with the missus. So that's about all I did. Not, not a whole lot of actually exciting things, but... I mean, getting to play this game, I was excited to wake up and just play this game this morning. It was so, so exciting. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button, I still managed to get that, by the way. <laughs> I don't know how I did that. <laughs> Like, I, I deadass pressed A, and then I clearly, I clearly was like, oh shit, press B. Also, I somehow got a great. Only. Wait, actually, out of curiosity, can I, can I kill him with a hammer? <laughs> I killed him with a lucky five damage. Oh, that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> See, you can technically do damage, it just doesn't do it. It just doesn't do much. Oh, what's that shit over there? Oh, it's one of those. It's like Luigi in Luigi's Mansion 2 when he unlocks a door, he's just like, oh. <laughs> literally, literally what went, what went on with me there. Oh. 
That fucking, like, voice clip is such a mood. Oh, those guys also drop one-ups. That's pretty dope. These guys take so much freaking damage, though. It's actually insane. Let me dab. Watchful Eye! Yay, a 1-Up DX. The 1-Ups look a lot more green. Or not green, they look a lot more blue. Like, dark green slash blue in this. Which is kinda neat. Also, just for shits and giggles, let's see the failed hammer animation. <laughs> we haven't seen those yet, because I haven't need- I haven't want- I didn't want to fail the frickin' Ash commands, but th those are always really funny when you fuck up Ash commands. They always put so much effort into those. Meow. Alright, bro, he's putting his hands up. Alright, let's try out the failed jump animation as well. Well, it's not as funny, though. Gotti. What if we fuck up the second one? <laughs> okay, that was worth it. That was- that was very worth seeing. See, I'm just fucking up all the action commands to see all the animations and stuff. Cause fun me. Cause they put all that effort in all the animations, so I wanna, you know, show them off. Okay, what about the hammer animation? <laughs> I mean, I think I've ever seen that one. Alright, what about the jump? <laughs> oh, these are hilarious. That comes out way faster than I think it should. Okay, the, the third animation's not as funny. Um... That actually killed? Oh my god. I don't think there's any other ones. Yeah, I don't think there's any other funny animations I can show off. Boing. More Moony, give me that Moony. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Why'd that happen? Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe doing what I was doing is a bad idea. I should wait it out. Oh yeah, we're supposed to go over here. Wahoo! These are fun. Alright, let's take this back. We gotta take it a while. We gotta take it a ways back. Thank God for slopes, am I right? I mean, if there wasn't slopes, we could still do the passing thing. Yeah. Oh, fuck, I'm going the wrong way! <laughs> oh, wait, hang on. Now, yeah, let me put this down real You can't do that here! Wait, yeah, hang on, let me leave that there. Money! I'm hoping that thing doesn't despawn. <laughs> okay, good, it didn't. 
So we go down here and plug it in. Yeah. Let's actually make use of the heart block. <laughs> I find it weird that they give us BP and we have nothing to use BP on for the first like seven hours of the gameplay, bro. So that's still one of the craziest things to me. I hate this, I don't want this. But no one will shut up about you guys. Brumble doesn't like you. So you're the one who broke all the islanders, arts and crafts. Huh, you're weird and tasty looking. I do not look tasty. I'd be terrible bad at a dip in sauce. Uh, I don't like this. I don't like any of it. They made me an outcast. They won't talk to me. I'm gonna use these fish to break it all. Then everyone will pay attention to me. I'm gonna destroy. Oh shit! All right, boss time. We're gonna square up. Let me just listen to this. Let me just jam out to this music real quick. It's very, very, very groovy boss theme. <laughs> Oh, we got like we get like dynamic camera angles when you go idle. That's really cool. <laughs> this could be a screensaver. It really does sound like some fucking um, cuphead music. <laughs> yeah, I like this. This is good. Forty-two damage. Nice. Yeah, gotcha, bitch. Yeah! Bro's angry. Ow. Dang, okay. He, he kind of kicked the shit out of me there. See, even he's jamming out to the music now. <laughs> Kinda dodging. Oh yeah. oh yeah! Oh, he is really fucking slow. <laughs> Yo, check out these frickin' dynamic camera angles. What do they got going on in the background there? Oh, this is a really good first boss. 
Oh, that's that shit in the background. Leave it to me. Hey, you find out something, Luigi. Luigi logic. Luigi can sometimes look at boss enemy behavior or environment and get a flash of inspiration that can change everything. When this happens, try hitting the Luigi logic command block on Luigi's turn to cock try out whatever scheme he's concocted. What? <laughs> if you successfully execute a Luigi logic plan, you'll get the chance to deal huge damage to a boss. Luigi logic plans always require Mario's cooperation. If he's KO'd, use a one-up mushroom item to recover. Oh. <laughs> okay, sure. Hit the block back. <laughs> well, it didn't really give me much of a chance there, did it? <laughs> We, we can try the Luigi logic again in a sec. It's kind of like a pseudo replacement for Bros attacks right now. Oh, nice. Nice counter there. Counters feel like they do more damage, honestly. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, it's a timing thing. That's why. Ooh, damn. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, critical. Damn. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're gonna... We're beating his ass. Damn, look at all that damage, bro. It'd be funny if I killed him with a counter attack. I think he's almost dead. Alright, one more hit. Let's let's end it funnily. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh, yeah. oh, that was so fun. Lucky. Lucky. Level nine. Very cinematic for the first boss, too. Oh, here's the Mr. Rossetti theme again. Oh. You guys, listen to me. What's come over you? I hoped I was wrong when I thought it was you, Garumbla. Auntie! This boy used to hang around my house a long time ago. Not sure when that stopped. It's too late for scolding. You stopped paying attention to me, Auntie. Everyone did. No one looked at me. So, so I... Don't be a spoiled brat. That's your dumb reason for smashing up people's artwork. You want people to notice you? To talk to you? To care about you? Then try making them happy. Looks like I gotta knock some sense in here. Tough love attack. Dang, she's going saying. <laughs> wow. Wow, she really did go saying. Holy shit. To think he used to be such a good boy. 
I used to let you might be even tougher than you two. Well, uh... We're so glad you're safe. Yeah, everything's fine thanks to Mario and Luigi. Thank you! But the island is wrecked, and everyone's arts in pieces. Huh. So we'll make it again. Huh? It doesn't matter how bad it's messed up or how many pieces it's in now. If we remember how we felt making it, we can do it again. Over and over. Yeah, you're right. Alright, let's work together to make our island beautiful again. Woohoo! Man, the trees just get it. It's just gonna get better and better. Ooh, looks like we have a new path now. Separated currents have been reconnected. Gotta say, you two came through where it counted. Maybe you really can fix Concordia back up again. Fingers crossed, anyway. She just has the fucking, um... Ra's voice from Monsters, Inc. <sighs> I suppose I should tell X about this incident. He and the others will be wanting a full report. Come on, let's beat it back to Ship Shape Isle in the air. You can use this if you want a shortcut. I owe you two for putting an end to all that drama. Yo, it's the fucking pipe from Dream Team. This was the easy part. It's only gonna get rougher from here. The return pipe will let you warp to the islands where connectors flowing. Hey, yes, Andy. We can use this to go straight to Ship Shape Island now. Any guesses who made it? A hint. Me. I, I'm building Megan's mom after all. I can build this stuff in my sleep. Yeah, yeah, let's use it already. Just press ZR to use it. You did take care, okay? We have fast travel now, guys. That's pretty fucking sick. And also the music's back to normal now. But hang on, I'm not done on the island quite yet. Wasn't there- there were- there was some more shit I could look at over here. Yeah, I, I saw that. Well, since we can- since we can go up here now, we're gonna explore the rest of the island since those fuckers didn't let me explore before. So let's go up here. Unless they're gonna stop me again, which would be dumb. I love traveling. You get to meet new people and see new things. It's been a while since I've been able to visit any other islands. The art here is all so interesting. I'll remember it as long as I live. Yeah, well, I hate to break it to you, buddy, but the art here is kind of... Kind of got fucked up. <laughs> oh yeah, all this stuff we can break now. Crash Bandicoot. Super Mushroom. Hey, that's our first Super Mushroom. Okay, so what we got? We got a nerd and some gold radish. More moony. Hey, I got 1k now. That's pretty dope. I think that's everything. Pipe can't be placed here. Oh! Where can I place a pipe? Return to Ship Shape Island. Or to head to another island. Oh, that's pretty dope. Yeah, hang on. Um, to show that I'm not crazy, can I look up the golden pipes from Dream Team? Let me see. 
Mario and Luigi Dream Team Warp Pipes. Um, I really does not want to show me that, does it? <laughs> Hold on, I can, I can find it, I can find it. Dream Team. There's no images of the golden warp pipes, bro. Hold on, give me a sec. You want us crazy, guys? I can't fucking find any actual images of the gold pipes from Dream Team. I, 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 that's honestly surprising. I thought there'd be more images of that, but I guess not. Mario Luigi! You saved Rumble Island! A visitor from there told me all about it. Yay! It isn't much, but please take these with my thanks. Oh shit! We got bros attacks! That, that could be a thumbnail right there. You can now practice bros attacks in the Snowlet school menu. I found them on the beach. I thought you two might use, find a use for them. Never seen a shell that looks like those. Think anything's inside? I don't know. I don't fucking care anyway. Heaven knows what could be cooped up in that kind of shell. How huh, would well, I know all about it? Glad you like them. Thanks a lot, really. Oh, and now the shops are opened up here, too. Did you hear you, dear? Looks like Wilma's daughter's coming to ship shape. Coming, nothing. Look over there. Oh my, maybe they'll live together again, mother and daughter, under the same roof. Wouldn't that be nice? Think so, anyway. Well, I hear the child hasn't gone to visit her at home yet. Is that so? Oh dear, well, I suppose Wilma could be a little intimidating. Why didn't she silence the whole island with that thunderous toot of hers? Oh, we got too far. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> the posh ladies laugh. It's the stashes with a flash, hey! You're asking if I plan on visiting mom at home? I'm not going home in a hurry. Unless the line between her love and anger can be blurry. Sure, but you could at least show your face! If you're so hot to bring me home to mother, then the least you could do is come with me, brother. Me? I got a job to do here. But you say hi to her for me. I give. I moaned. I'm going home. Back to Rumble Isle. Time to find my smile. Look me up if you'll ever be there for a while. Oh, absolutely, I'm kind of worried for her. You'll go to Rumble Isle and check on her? Nice. I owe you guys big time. Picnic boots. Oh, side quests. Wait, they got side quests in this game now? As you link islands, you'll encounter side quests with the people of Concordia. Oh my god. Hell yeah! At the end of each side quest, you get a special gift. <laughs> Listen closely to the ladies' gossip for hints on the latest side quests. Sometimes folks on Shipshape Island or out in Concordia will make requests for Mario and Luigi. Look for an icon floating over their heads. Talk to them and the side quest will begin. Clear side quests to earn useful items and learn more about the people you meet. Some side quests also have to complete in a limited time, and some side quests become unavailable after you pass certain points. Oh. <laughs> Completionists beware. Oh shit. Map icons can serve as hints about your progress. If an icon doesn't have a mark, it means there's a side quest you haven't looked into. Head to the spot marked by the icon. An icon marked with an arrow indicates that you've accepted a quest at the icon's location. An icon with a check mark indicates that a side quest can be cleared by talking to the quest giver. Okay. The color of a quest can change as a as the deadline for its side quest approaches. Hmm. Okay, we gotta decide where to steer ship shape. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna be doing um, I'm gonna be doing those side quests as much as possible then. The wait is over, my shop's open. Show me any useful materials you find, and I'll turn into awesome gear. Oh, here we go, this is where the materials come in handy. 
and build its workshop, you can have it make special gear for you. To get build it building, find him on ship shape, it's like here request to get the details. Hand over the materials he needs, he'll make gear for you. Okay. There's gotta be something you could want. Battle ready gloves? These increase your power at the start of battle. They're fantastic. Just need a few things first. Oh, well, good thing I have two rumble stones. Uh, what about battle wearing gloves? These got the damage you take at the start of battle. I think I have that. Yeah, give him. Great, I'll build it right away. This will this won't take a second. I built it. Yeah. Now that I've got the trick down. I'm gonna sell these in my shop. Thanks a lot. Hooray! Okay, and then I think we have these. Oh, I don't have I don't have it yet. Okay. But what 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 am I missing? Oh, he's got he's oh yeah. Well, I definitely want the battle ready gloves. <laughs> yeah, definitely give those to Mario. All right. Also, we have extra gear slots, so we can put on more shit anyway. Hmm. Have a chance to give you the first turn in a combat in combat. Boost damage by first strikes by 50%. Makes defeated enemies drop items more often. Hmm. I can give this to Mario. I mean, for right now, it's not bad. And then I can uh, slide on over the, um... Hang on. Let me look at my gear. I can slide the battle ready gloves on over to Mario or onto Luigi. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Wait, so I actually have two battle ready gloves. I didn't even notice. Also, I have so so boots. Okay, so side quest is there now. Coming home. See how Wilma's family is doing. Um, okay, I need twisty leaves. Damn it, why did I sell all my twisty leaves? Fuck. Well, guess we're going back to twisty at some point. Alright, well, we're going back we're going back to Rumble Island again. <laughs> because of course we are. Now, this really is gonna become like bug fables where I just do like a shit ton of side quests for an episode and then finally make progress. But hey, it'll make the game longer, which is good. Hey, I mean I can't say there's ever been side quests in um in a Mario and Luigi game before. Well, there's kinda of been. Rumble Isle's got some good music. You know, I'm just keeping an eye out to see if there's anybody that with requests here on the island, you know? It's another reason to return to all the islands, potentially, uh... You know... Get new requests. Well, let's go check on the family. Which I believe is over here. Oh! I know you've been feeling queasy because you couldn't see me, so please go easy. What are you talking about? I'm just glad you're doing okay. Did you think I was upset? Is that why you weren't coming home? I mean... 
What's the intention? Why even mention? So I've been sowing anxiety. Not exactly sly of me. Oh, time out. A gift of gratitude for putting up with my nerves and attitude. Hey, come on, I know how important that is to you. A tool is made to be used. If you didn't want it recorded, you shouldn't have taught it. I no longer want it. I on hold on. Go ahead and adopt it. Thanks a million for finding my kids. I really miss them. I owe you guys. I'm not too bold for my blood to run cold, thinking of how hard mom used to scold. I still remember how she'd get irate, ir irate my bro and I up late. On and on we played. <laughs> irate, that's a word I don't hear very often. Um, so we can put the picnic boots on uh, Mario. Oh yeah, so now here it shows that you have different attack for your jump and hammer. Which is really cool. Still nothing in the settings and guide. Oh wait, so there's, a, there's a quest over there. Hmm, I can't do it as good as build it. Build is my hero. He was a clumsy kid, but he got past it to be the best. I'm clumsy too, so I took up to build it. I've been working hard to get better. Is there anyone else who could teach me how to use a hammer? Sure. What? You'll teach me how to use a hammer? Yeah! One more time. <laughs> yeah! Come on, green guy, join in! We get a fun little side quest. Mamma mia! Hoist it above your head and swing! I see. Yeah, I'm getting into the swing of things. Yeah! Thank you. And let this reward be your second thank you. Yes! I'm gonna hit it big! Heart bean! Let's have a look at those beans. Let's give the speed beans to Luigi. To gay Luigi. Huh. I guess those boo biscuits aren't gonna get any use, are they? <laughs> Dang, that's too bad. Oh, here we go. Get 30 excellence with the red shell bros attack. Get 30 excellence with the green shell bros attack. Yep, I had a feeling these are all linked to the bros attacks. Dodge oh, I love all the little icons for them. These are great. Dodge your counter attacks on their times. Still haven't used items in battle yet. <laughs> Maybe we'll get to that at some point. Okay, so this is coins in battle, not on the overworld, which is a completely different thing. I'm kind of curious what these three are, then. It's not related to beating enemies, obviously. These are all related to doing damage, and these are all related to getting coins, so... I'm not sure, honestly. An invitation to the spa. Destination Rainforest Island. Check on the husband. So you have more reasons to come back to the old islands, I'd say. That's a good thing. Oh, well, here's the great thing, though, right? You can head to another island straight from here. So now we have actual fast travel in Mario and Luigi. <laughs> That's pretty fucking dope. 
Well, considering the fact that side quests are time, um, what's the word? Time sensitive? I'd rather just get them done as soon as possible. So yeah, anyways, my question is, where is this, um... Where is this at? Where is this the guy at? Okay, to the right. <laughs> God damn it, I fell. Thankfully you can jump up here. Hey, the turnips are back! Thank god these turnips exist. Get a shit ton of moon me back. Wait, the gold one's back too? Oh, hell yeah. Nah, I'm not finding the, the frickin' Koopeleons again. Those guys are old news. Really old news, actually. This is awful! Someone's over there! He's gonna fall! Someone's gotta save him fast! Oh, okay. <laughs> Well, thankfully, we already have this cleared. Hey! Oh, sorry. I was having a bad dream that I was on the edge of being trivial. Huh? What are you all doing down there? What? Oh, I didn't mean to cause all this trouble. Sorry, everyone. Didn't mean to make you all panic. I was fine, just having a nap, that's all, really. Oh, he was just sleeping. We're in our cells for nothing. Good thing he's okay, though. <laughs> How embarrassing. You never know that I'm kind of a big deal. Or at least I used to be. I used to work in the city. People used to greet me with, Hey boss, and big boss coming through. Ah, oh, then came to a terrible day when I woke up to get to work. And the land was broken into pieces, so I couldn't go to the city. That was a good while ago. But then came another terrible day. I hadn't gone to work for so long that I knew they'd replace me. So I lost all hope. Worst of all, I lost all of my boss energy. But then, you know what my dear wife said? Stop that sulking, you love work and get out there. It wasn't pretty, but she had it right. I had to get a job to get me back. <laughs> well, you had me word for, there for a second there, I thought she was about to say I'm breaking up with you. <laughs> I wandered here and there trying to find a job I'd be good at. Finally, right here on this island, I found what I was looking for. Sweet! Exercise, fresh air. Good, honest, physical work here among the trees. Only one problem. I'm getting too old for big, bold moves. Oh. My back just can't take this kind of honest work. Huh? Would you like go back to Ship Shape Isle for a change of pace? Sure, show me the way. Yes. I see. And I can get back to the island using that pipe? Perfect, thanks. Hey, we did it. Do I need to go back to the island to accept my reward or what? I think I do. Do, 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 do. Alright, let's go, let's go talk to the old man. Oh, thanks for helping me out. The wind here feels so good. But it doesn't take away any of the pain. Mario, Luigi, is something bothering you? Well, I was actually going to open a relaxation spot for everyone here. Would you like to try a test massage? We're still twerking out the kinks. Of course, of course. How about you two join me 
for a bit of backcracking spa time. Oh, ouch! Ugh. How's the backcrack connection? <laughs> but I got some syrups. Mario, Luigi! A beam of light shot out of the Unitree! Kapu! Did you see it? Yes! Even better, it fixed the broken sea current. Sure looks that way, yeah, but what was that light? Uh, yeah, that light. It seems familiar. A great lighthouse, maybe? Yes, you're right. Looks like the light from a great lighthouse. A light from a great lighthouse, but why would it come from the Unitree? Oh, I don't know. Hmm, they've got to be connected in some way. Well, whatever the reason, the light seems to be showing us the way to go. That's what I think. Right, it's a safe bet that there's a great lighthouse somewhere in the fixed current. So, if we can get that lighthouse working, it's got to show us the way to go again. Ah, the Great Lighthouse is full of enemies right now. Eh, uh, what were you even doing at that lighthouse, Ark? Actually... When the land split apart, I got stranded with my dad on Rainforest Island. I was looking around in nearby waters and I saw the islands floating by, one by one. We knew something bad had happened in Concordia. Why'd the land break apart? We kept surveying the seas trying to find the answer. Then one day a dark shadow crept up from us behind. By the time we noticed it was already too late. Just like that we are carried off to a great lighthouse. I saw it all. Such strange creatures. Oh, hey, there's the Thorb enemies from Dream Team. After that, I don't remember so much. What about your dad? Oh, um, I... Ark. No need to worry. I'm sure dad's fine. It's just... No, it's nothing. Oh, bro probably misses his dad. He just doesn't want to admit it. Forget it. Let's just get to that great lighthouse, okay? We'll teach those strange creatures a lesson. Oh, we'll store the great lighthouse's light. Why does everybody have a freaking New Jersey accent? Huh? The thing I was about to say before? Yes! So I was hoping, Mario, Luigi, will you find my spyglass for me? I thought it'd just be a nuisance before, but I couldn't bring myself to ask. I'm pretty sure it'd still be there somewhere on Rainforest Island. Well, I gotta go back there? Well, this is a special side quest, okay. Alright, well, we gotta do that one stat, then. Hey, it's the lady... Is that lady from before? She said she's something about liking rare, oddly shaped reefs. She said the view from ship shape is great, so they're easy to spot. So, what's a reef? Hmm. Honestly, I still haven't figured that out. Hello! Hmm, you guys. Oh, I see. I didn't think you guys would be Mario and Luigi. Oh, yeah. Yes! Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ah, that rocks. I have a request for you. You guys are linking up drifting islands, right? If so, while you're out looking for drifting islands, I'd like you to find rare reefs for me. Mm. Of course, there'll be something in it for you. If you find a lot of reefs for me, there's a reward in it for you. Oh, yeah. yeah! I guess if we can do it on the side, we might as well try it. <laughs> that rocks! 
Also, if you take a good look at the ocean map, you can make out the positions of the reefs. It'd rock if you could use the big cannon to get a good look at a reef sheet. Hmm, I'm looking forward to it. Alright, so yeah, let me look at- I, I need to understand this mechanic. In Concordia Seas, you'll sometimes spot rare reefs with strange shapes. Notice them on the ocean map, discover them through the big can scopes, and then tell is a rock. She reward you based on the number you found. Ah. Oh. You know what, let's fuck around with that right now. Well, how do I zoom in exactly? Do I have to use the ocean map or what? Some damn good looking, uh. Some damn good looking water still. We ain't found shit. I mean, surely if I just keep staring out like this, I'll find them eventually, right? To my knowledge, there is no way to zoom in. I think it, you're just limited to this view. Hmm. Nice look at the, 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 the front part of the, you know, ship. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't seen crap. Oh, hey, look, you can see the save block over there. That's nice. Um, is that a reef right there? I mean, honestly, you could just you could just stare at this for hours, and you could probably find some stuff. <laughs> but I don't know if I really have the patience for that exactly. Well, how will I know when I found a reef exactly? Will I be able to lock onto it or what? That's what I'm not sure about. I mean, I see a little rock structure over there. We got some bird ups right there. Okay, you know, I give this a few more minutes. If I don't come across anything, I'm dipping. Yeah, it's just yeah, it's just a regular ass rock structure. Well, what are those? What are these rocks? All what are these rocks anyway? That's what I'm wondering about. Oh wow, damn! This map is way bigger than I thought. We've barely even scratched the surface of this game. Oh wait, hang on a second. Are these the reefs she's talking about right here? That might that might be it actually. I don't think there are any reefs yet. What time am I at by the way? An hour twenty-eight? Yeah, I might do a few side quests and we'll call it a day. I'm kind of getting tired, honestly. It's, uh, it's like 11 p.m. now. Man, <laughs> I get so tired these days when playing games, but yeah, it's so fun. My, my, no, that is a fine mustache you have there. That reminds me, the better your stash, the more likely you'll be lucky in battle. <laughs> nice reminder, as always. Well, let's, um... Oh, I found a new funny button. <laughs> oh, that's a great, that's a great button right there. Oh! <laughs> You know, I like that the more side quests we do, the more populated this place becomes, too. Well, well, welcome! I'm gonna sell some crap. Like the so so boots. And my other pair of so so boots. Um. 
Well, no reason to sell the build-it gloves, I guess. But. Yeah, I think this is fine. Well, are there any other, um... No, these are the same. Treasure specs are cool, though. Next time I go to, um... What's it called? Island. We'll get some more stuff. I heard Rainforest Island has monsters that turn invisible. Oh yeah, I think I read that. So what's the what's the deal with this beach down here exactly? I don't know. We should check it out. I feel like I sound better when singing. Yeah, I read that already. Not sure what the deal with this beach is, but hey, hey, it looks nice at least. Yeah, I'm still wondering when are we gonna go back to that island that we started the game on? That's kind of been bugging me for a little while now. I mean, I don't mind too much, honestly. Also, let's go to that current real quick. We need to prepare for that, <laughs> for next time we go to a new island. For now, we can go to a rainforest again. I mean, there is a lot out there. Are, the fact that there are so many side quests in this game means this might be one of the more jam-packed Mario and Luigi games we've had in a while, which is good. I mean... I could tell you guys, like, my Dream Team playtime. My Dream Team playtime was, like, 50 hours. And that was with getting all of the expert challenges. Oh, like, Spyglass has gotta be here somewheres. Maybe someone picked it up. Guess we better ask around. Yeah, maybe somebody did pick it up. Spyglass? Haven't seen one, sorry. I gotta talk to every NPC to figure out if they have a spyglass or not. Do you master carrying things? Hmm. I went over here already. Oh, good job, Luigi. <laughs> Well, you know what? This is the perfect time to try out our bros attacks. Yeah, I mean, I, I know how bros attacks work. Come on. Stat changes. Oh, hell yeah. Stat changes can affect pow, defense, speed, and stash. Enemies can also boost their stats. I'm glad that it actually tells you. You know. Alright, let's try out the new red shell. Oh. Whoa, whoa, that is a really fucking weird red shell. Hold on a second. Wait, so... Wait. Okay, that feels more normal. Also, I love these fucking finishers. They're so good. Okay, well, hang on. I'm confused. Why was Mario's weird? Why did Mario kick it to Luigi? I need, I need to get into another encounter and test that. I know I can test that out in the menu, but that's no fun. I want to test that on a real enemy. Also, these power gloves are fucking OP. <laughs> the fact that you start the battle with 20% extra pow is kind of bust kind of busted. Let me try this again. So he kicks it to Luigi. Oh, that's a really cool spin on the red shell on, on the 3D red shell. Oh my god! 
Damn. Holy shit. That just did 128 damage. Okay, so that's interesting. Luigi's green shell is like the classic one, and Mario's is like a creative spin on the old formula. I kind of like that, actually. Oh, that's fucking awesome. Uh, it doesn't tell you the total, though, when you kill the enemy. That's another thing that kind of bugged me. <laughs> With those, some of those multi-hit moves. Because it would never tell you how much damage you did total. Wait, Spyglass, you say? I might have seen something like that over there, maybe. Over there? What do you mean, over there? Over where? <laughs> that only sort of helps. Mazda took over our favorite spot. What can we do? Do? I think we just have to wait and hope to go somewhere else. Looks like it's trying to protect something valuable. Tread carefully there, buddy. Alright, encounter time. What's gleaming back there? Is it the spyglass we're looking for? Maybe. These guys are gonna be. Oh, there's five of them though. All right, let's do it. I love that. It just does so freaking much damage. Oh, but Luigi's is multi-target, so his is, in some ways, better. Yeah! Oh shit, and the final hit hits- The final hit is multi-target, too. That is also sick. Yeah, because it's overkill, I know, but I want to get the, uh... I want to get that achievement. That is so satisfying. Well, at least we're not gonna have any shortage of rainforest vines. So that's pretty banger. I got you. You got Arch Spyglass. I kind of forgot that's what a spyglass is. <laughs> nice. Let's give it back to Ark. Yeah. Let me just get my uh my pipe ready. Man, it is really cool seeing the gold pipes again. I just, I just love that. And no, they're not the uh, gold pipes from frickin' Mario Party. Those are bad. <laughs> I got it. I got it. You found my spyglass. Thank you so much. I'll never forget this as long as I live. I'm gonna look out for the, to the sea with it right now. I can see so far. I'm glad we were able to find it for you, good buddy. This spyglass, it brings back so many memories of my dad. We get lore. I can't see it today either. No, there's no unit tree. Right, the connector's flow is still blocked. The lighthouse here is out. Great lighthouse too, I guess. What in the world is happening? Don't want to think about it, but something must have happened to the unit tree. 
All we can do is hope that Corzette, Cosette knows how to fix this. Whoever that is. You mean Cosette the Wine Nest? Yes, that's right. Cosette the Wine Nest. If something's up with the unit tree, she's the one who'll know what to do. It's the Wine Nest's job to light the Great Lighthouse. What's gonna happen now? The world. Won't it go back to how it was before? The world with no connector is like, well, it's like you without a mustache. Are we done for? Is there no hope at all? I wonder if I could carry on without a mustache. Ark, this is a dangerous time for sure. Without enough connector, the lights will start going out. Our way of life will become difficult. Only yesterday I was making a plug radish cake. The oven went off, but my cake was only half baked. The continent's in pieces. We don't know what's become of the Unitree, or Cosette. But understand this, son. If you lose heart, then you really are done for. This is exactly the kind of time when you need to keep moving forward. We'll find our way. We'll make sure the connector flows freely again. That's right, Dad. We'll get it flowing again for sure. That's my boy. That was good. Oh. And that's when it all happened. Man, that's a f that's some surprisingly deep story. Especially with that music and that like, what even do you call that filter? I don't know. Just like that, they whisked us off to the great lighthouse. Oh, that's it. It was my dad. He put me in that capsule and sent me out to sea. I see. Maybe he's still at the Great Lighthouse. Oh, yeah. yeah! Yeah, he must be. Like he said, this is exactly the kind of time we need to keep moving forward. Meaning, let's head to the next island. Oh, I got an arc scope as a, uh, as a reward. I mean, I guess that makes sense that it wouldn't tell you that gear. So what does that do? Increases experience by 15% if you win without taking damage. Oh, hell yeah. Huh. You wanna know who I'm giving that to? <laughs> Luigi. <laughs> I know. I'm I'm, cru I'm I'm a cruel bastard that way. I mean, if I could swap the gear between the bros easily, maybe I could do that as well. Unless that gear applies for both the bros. I doubt it does, though. So do we have any other side quests? Well, besides this one. I don't think there's any other side quests we can do right now. Okay, so... I want to go to that current, because that's the new shit right there. It'll, um, kind of take a sec to get there, though, so... What can I do in the meantime? Nothing real. There's not really much I can do in the meantime, honestly. I might just wait this one out, honestly. Yeah. I want to at least get to the next island so I don't have to, you know, spend the next episode freaking waffling around trying to figure out where to go. So, yeah. I'll meet. I'll meet you guys back when the uh, island is in view. Okay, there is one really weird thing I noticed, though. There is no heart blocks on Ship Shape Island. Which is really, really weird. I don't know why it's like that. Also, I noticed there is a, um... I noticed R is mapped to, um, quests now, so that's pretty cool. And I'm assuming maybe the minus... Well, the minus button's mapped to this. So I think the only button that isn't mapped to anything right now is ZL. That might be mapped to something later, I don't know yet. So now we're basically getting every button mapped to something. Like, we have our fast travel button, we have our quest button, we have our, you know, Luigi button. So, almost every button has a feature now. It's just 
L, or Z ZL, that isn't mapped to anything, and I guess the, you know, L3 and R3, too? So where is that new island, anyway? I think we need to go a bit further to get in view of it. Wait, hang on, there's something on the map there. I saw something. I think that might have been one of the reefs or something. Ocean map. Oh no, they're like, those are like fishies. What are those fishies doing there? Who knows? Who knows what the fishies are there for? They sure do exist, though, and we got bird ups as well. I mean, I don't think I can just chill on this map screen, honestly. That might be more easy. So we're slowly uncovering the map. Ooh, and there's another current there. Okay, so... Are these... I'm confused what these are. Are these, are these like, reefs, or are these new currents? Or new, like, islands to go to? That's what I'm not too sure about yet. Although, if I, if I, um... Well, actually, maybe I should go this way. Because if I go this way, then I can get the, um... Maybe I can get that current. Who knows? I'll meet you guys back in a second. Alright, the map is slowly getting a little bit more filled out, so... Let's have a look. Let's have a look and see if that reef is in view. I think, I mean, it's supposed to be. What is that? I can, like, see it on the map. Oh, there it is. Hey, there he is! Weeping Lion Reef. Damn, that's a lot of reefs! They are mapped- they are marked on the map, though, so that's pretty helpful. Okay. So now what we need to do is we need to go to this current. Oh my god, that's gonna take so fucking long, though. Jeez. That's my biggest complaint with this game so far, is you can't get there any quicker. You just have to wait it out. That's so annoying. Oh well. I'll meet you guys there then, I guess. Alright, we're making a little bit of progress. We're making a little bit of progress, guys. I kind of want to open up a bit more of this. Ugh. I don't know if it's worth- I don't know where this one goes. Man, these currents are freaking weird, bro. I'm telling you. I'm gonna see if I can get that reef. So, yeah, I'll meet you guys there as well. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Something just opened up. I think that's a new island or something. Yeah. Okay, so we can go there at some point. Maybe we'll go there and save. But first, I need to go get that, um... Yeah, I want to go over there. We need to get that reef, bro. I'm telling you, I, I want to 100% this game so I can get that reef, you know? <laughs> Does that make sense? Alright, here, here, it's coming, it's coming. We need to, um... We need, we need to get ready for this reef coming up here. Oh wait, I'm still in the mi I'm still in this menu. <laughs> I kind of forgot I just had the minus button open this whole time. So how will I know when I see it? It's like somewhere around here. Aha! Uh -huh. Pensive Reef. <laughs> well, look at that. I've already found two of them. This better be freaking worth it, man. Because now I gotta wait all the way until I can loop back around to this island. Oh my god. This is actually tedious. What the fuck? Okay, apparently I'm in range of this new island. Oh. 
Floral Island. Wait, I think this is. A, I think this island was also in the trailers. Let's go there. <laughs> and suddenly, Sonic 06 load screen. That'd be pretty funny. <laughs> Alright, here we go. New island. <laughs> Luigi fell in the fucking water. Mario. Dude, that's that's gonna that's one thing I'm excited about. Every new island. I'm just curious on how Luigi's gonna eat shit every time. So I'm loving the freaking like French inspired music in this game. Did I just see you guys fall from the sky? Yes! You're from Ship Shape Island, and you got shot here by a cannon? Holy smokes! There's such a thing as being too committed to the bit. Hey, Boo Biscuit. Anything I can interest you in? Uh, any new gear worth picking up? A uh, picnic hammers? I mean, those might be worth getting. Cozy wear. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. We'll see. Might be worth getting one of these for Luigi, honestly. There we go. Um... Not sure. Let's get the picnic boots for Luigi as well. At least I got a free one, so I don't have to spend money on it. Thank you! And I, I still haven't used a single item in battle yet. <laughs> that's, that's fucking crazy, dude. Now that, that's, that's gonna change now, though, because we actually have Rose attacks. And I still don't see a freaking heart block anywhere. Why are heart blocks actually dead ass so rare? Hmm. Might be time to actually use one of my syrups soon. Well. I'll let that be- I'll let that be Minus's problem for tomorrow, or whenever I play this game again. So, yeah. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching Mario and Luigi Brothership. Make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. And, uh, we'll continue more of this game. We're gonna do the next island. So, see you guys then.